we have a veteran who has been featured in 100. So I don't know. I, don't, I think 100 might be too small. Exactly. So, <laughs> it's like putting, it's like. Because some people that started yesterday, don't 100. <laughs> so I was small. He was active. And you know, start. I, Even while we're babies, we'll ask him, right, we'll ask him right, right now. But we have a Jesse and Mecca <laughs> Rollers. He is, of course, an accomplished non wood leader whose craft and hard work has earned him both local and, and global, global recognition. He is, of course, the president of the Actors Guild of, of Nigeria. Nigeria. It's great to have welcome. you, Mr. President. You're Thank welcome, you. sir. Thank you. The first question, let me, let's be sure. Do you have a catalog? <laughs> Do you know how many movies you have done? No, usually uh, the work is not counted by how many movies. Mm. Because originally, outside this, uh, uh, outside this incline, for instance, it's not by how many movies, it's mm. by how many quality movies have you done. Mm. But you know Nigeria is counted for number of what they churn out. But if you look at the qualities of the number of what they churn out, you see that they don't merge. Mm. So usually it's not by how many movies have done. You've done. Okay. The, another thing you count is that the commercial successes, maybe producers are quick to rush to the market to make a film. Mm -hmm. So because they are quick to rush to the market, before this one is finishing, they are doing another, another one, one and all of so that forms why you see a lot of people. A lot of movies out there. Mm -hmm. Then again, for me, because at some point I decided to do administration, which is like mm. the Gen Z people have come mm. and they are doing it without structure, without uh, a lot of things. learning mm. things. So we said, no, we have to guide them properly because if we don't, we may not have the industry in the next 20 years. Mm. Mm. Everything just, so it's not necessarily about how many movies have done. No. <laughs> now, okay. that you, now that you said that, there's something that you said that, that you know, sort of resonated with me because yes. over the week I had a conversation with a Gen Z actor. They seem to be taking over the Nollywood space right now. And it's good to see because we love their craft, right? But um, you talked about the lack of structure and the lack of ethics and the lack of certain things right now that used to be in, this, in the Nollywood industry that isn't right now. What are you doing as the president of the AGN, that's the Actors Guild of Nigeria, to put the structure in place to create, you know, that industry where even, you know, aspiring actors would mm. love to, you know, come and work? Sure, we've, we've been doing a lot. We've been doing a lot and we, ha we still have a lot that we are planning to do. First of all, you know, Nollywood didn't have an entry point or exit point and it's not supposed to be so. For here, the industry grew out of uh, private passion, private partnership passion. So because of that, 60% of those who were part of beginning the industry called Nollywood, some of them were not very schooled. So their interest is make a film, make the money. Now, gradually it began to change. More money began to come. And then practitioners who are coming very lately, they didn't see anywhere to hold hands. But now we're changing it. It's, it sounds somehow that you just came out from your village because you have uh, a, talent. a talent. You start working. Some of those people who have these talents, when you bring them on set and tell them, cut, they mm -hmm. don't know what is cut. Mm. Freeze, they don't know what is freeze. Now, we are the actors get up that we said, okay, if you register with us today, you must pass through training which has to run within one year. It's not as if, if you're passing through training, you will not be acting. As you're training, you're also acting. How do you facilitate this training? How is this training it's done? Yeah, the training is done at all state chapter levels because the Actors Guild of Nigeria were present in 34 states. So if you register maybe in Borono State, for instance, <gasps> we organize a training for you two times in a year. Then at the end of the second training in the year, will now give you a certificate and identity card of membership. Mm. With that, when you go to any location, you know all the rules, you know the ethics that follows. Yeah, but then we have seen a few emerging <coughs> film academies right now in Nigeria that are quite uh, popular. And to be honest, if you had not said this now, I wouldn't even know that the Actors Guild of Nigeria, Nigeria actually has, has a true a facility that caters to actors yes. in that regard. So what is it that makes that, you know, makes this, uh, the, what the Act Actors Guild of Nigeria, what they're doing, stand out from the other film academies? Now, for the film academy, you find out that because there were not these structures, it gave room for people to set up 
academies. Mm. And now the Actors Guild of Nigeria, we work with all the academies. So if you were registered in any academy, for instance, maybe uh, Wale Adenuga Productions, you are registered in the academy. When you are done with that, the academy will also call the Actors Guild and say, OK, we have graduated 600 members, and we know they are top notch in the craft, but they need to become members of your guild so that they, their welfare will be covered. That mm. is specifically what the AGN does. So you have some sort of partnership with this of academy? Of course, all of the academies, we you have do. partnerships. Mm. Because at the end of the day, if you are from the academy and you are acting, you're not covered with any insurance because the academy doesn't give you insurance. Oh, but mm. the but Actors Guild of Nigeria does. does. Oh. See, do, yeah, yeah. That, that, those are things you don't know. To my next question, yes. What, what are the things that, what are the advantages of being a member of the guild? Because, I mean, you know, you could see somebody send out a casting call, one person, you know, can just enter and all of that. What are the advantages? He's an actor. He's not in, as a member. He's not in the no, actor. No, 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 no. Okay. Look, 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 what is the advantage of being a member of the guild? Actors Guild of Nigeria, as all other actors guild all over the world, their mm -hmm. main uh, preoccupation is to take care of the actor's mm -hmm. welfare, mm -hmm. fight for the actor. The agent is a voice for an average actor. So when you're a member of the guild and you have a problem with producer, you don't need to go fight producer. You just go sit at home, send a message to the actor's guild, and we'll come to your rescue. Oh, really? And apart from that, the health insurance came, comes from the guild. The group life insurance comes from the guild. The pension scheme comes from the guild. All of these things are managed in one uniform platform. Mm. So being a member is an advantage for you as an actor. That does not mean that we force people to become our members because... Membership of any association in Nigeria is voluntary. It's voluntary yeah. But when you look at what we offer, mm. you don't have any option than becoming a member. So how far, how many members does the guild currently have? Mm, that's we, one. In Nigeria today, we are about a million members. A million? Registered. Yes. Hold on. Okay. We have about a million members across 34 states. Mm. But do you pay members? Because your payment is an annual it's exactly, payment. Yeah, yeah. So I mean, that, that gives you the benefit. That cannot be recorded right? within, but right now we are, we, are, we are setting up uniform apps to check all of this put together because the work we're doing at the AGN is evolving. We have seen the large number. Recently, we, we just launched our Work for Life program. We have done that of Lagos. We finished that of Delta uh, last Tuesday. The work is to strengthen the awareness for our health insurance the group life insurance and the pension scheme because we want our members to retire blissfully. Mm. You have seen a lot of actors coming on the internet asking for funds to mm. cater for their health needs. This now, is because a lot of them mm. were not signing up to these schemes that were provided. Were provided. So we decided to do a, a kind of awareness, strengthen the awareness so that people who are filming in remote villages will know that they have this scheme once they pay their money. Because, I mean, mm. you just raised something very critical that I'm sure even my, Mike is, <laughs> is it just going, <laughs> having that light bulb moment right now. We have heard cases in the past, I mean, even the last one was actor Hank Sanuku, right? Yes, yeah. Where, you know, some of these actors have been seen in very, very critical Deploring cases. Yes, the yes, yes. conditions and stuff. And then the first thing, even with everybody goes, what's agent? Yes, what's agent? Yeah. Not the first even what are the actors are doing? Members. Members. So exactly. There's a limitation to what you can do. Exactly. If the person is not a member of AGN, is there anything that can be done? Does, exactly, you know, to come to their aid. No, if usually, I'm just saying, not like you have yeah, to. Usually, once, once you're an actor and we identify you're an actor, even if you fall short of these things, we will still come to your aid and then educate Wonderful. you mm. and then let you know. Uh, we partner with different organizations. For instance, you mentioned about uh, there are some actors presently who are on drugs and then we partner with NDLA to put them on rehab. Oh, oh. We are dealing wow. with all of those backstage wow. because we don't want yeah. you to come upstage and begin mm. to create okay. another sensation mm. and all of that. All of this thing happens, we, we do them with, you know, information. We continue talking to our people because Nigeria is one kind of place where people don't mind, people just mind their business until they have a problem. Sure. And once they have a problem, they will come call you out. Mm. But you won't allow them to keep dragging you. You just do the much you can do. Mm. We have recent cases of people who will just jump in the internet maybe because of one small problem that ordinarily, if you, were, if you belong to a very good HMO, you can take care of it. And then you come along. And we now said, okay, if you're an actor and you're a member and you fall sick, 
you don't rush to anywhere to beg for help. We can organize crowdfunding for you, but we must get a medical report, get a certified yeah. hospital saying this is your problem. Your problem exactly. So you don't go and keep begging people money. This set will contribute money for you. You probably go and rent a house with it. And then after about six months, you come back again on the internet. Mm. Money will be raised again. You go and buy a car and all of that. Mm. So we said, if you shout again and say you need money, we'll find out what is your case. Which hospital is taking care of you? Which medical report do you have? We have corporate bodies we can do letters to. And they will just support us on the ground mm. without you know, necessarily making it an mm. issue. An issue. An we issue. have also stopped people from donating to actors publicly. Wow. It is wrong for somebody to invite you to his church and announce that he's giving you 30 million naira. Who come after you for this one? Report. Exactly. No, who? Who? Because they, they say, okay, uh, it, it maybe it might be a serious situation, and they say that maybe that's where they can get help. Is it, who, 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 let, me, let, let me tell you, the people who have gotten all this money that I've mentioned, call them on phone and ask them how far. That's, that will tell you that it's also possible that Nollywood is vulnerable at this moment. People want to rise their social media followership by doing all of this. Mm -hmm. If you're a Christian and a pastor at that matter, the Bible said if you want to give, do not allow your left hand to know that mm -hmm. you're giving. Mm -hmm. Must you announce it publicly that come so that you now make it look like, okay, these people they don't have, we must give them. And I cut off ties with such people because if you want to help my association, you must do it the right way. I have people who have assisted sick people without even mentioning it. Names. So we have clamped down on that. If you must... Though that count our guild out is your personal decision. So, but the guild can do it. You can do it under the auspices of the guild. Oh, the That's what you are saying. Exactly. Okay. We'll now let secretly and then okay. it works out for you. Yeah, we have heard of a few mixed reactions that has trailed, you know, the Actors Guild of Nigeria as an association. We would like you, as the president, to address some of the challenges that you are facing and you have faced, and you know. Um, the way forward, I mean, what's the future for the Actors Guild? Okay, it depends on which angle you're coming from about uh, challenges, but you know, the Actors Guild of Nigeria first had seven years of leadership crisis. So during that period, a lot of people grew, some above the guild level at that point, some become so much more bigger than they felt. But when we came on board, we began to mend fences where we had uh, factions, we brought them together so we can have one unified actors' guild. Mm. And I can tell you, you know, take it to the bank that today we have one actors' guild of Nigeria. Yeah, not yeah, two. we've seen, we've seen that. And then you, you also know that some... different people rise up from different zones, localities, setting up mushroom associations either to cover this or cover that. There is no group that can come and say we are actors' guild of Nigeria. We are the only guild in Nigeria affiliated with Federation of International Actors, with NANTA, and we have very good twin relationship with the Screen Actors Guild of America, SAGAFTRA, and British Equity. Here in Nigeria, there is no other guild or association that cater for actors, if not the Actors Guild of Nigeria. Now, moving forward, uh, having said that, we are only trying to set up structures that will help the future generation. Mm. Stardom is transient. Mm -hmm. I can reel out names of Nigerian actors who, in the past 15 years, might have had their names in big places, but mm -hmm. today, they are nowhere to be found. Sure. Now, if we don't put down these structures, the ones coming after us and these yeah. young ones, they will not meet anything sure. out there. One of the greatest challenges we have as an industry is that we do not have enough legislative advocacy. The Actors Guild of Nigeria, we are setting up a group that we deal with National Assembly to really tell Nigeria what do we need in this sector. And the Guild is trying to bring everybody on board, whether you're small, whether you're big. You just have to know that this is your Guild. You will also understand that because Nollywood and actors, they are in the public, they are vulnerable to a lot of things. Mm. People want to use these people to shine. Mm. You hear gist of one sex tape there, one all of that there. We are taking time to look at all of this and bring members to know that when you have a problem, you run to your guild, we we'll call the legal people that will deal such matter. Mm -hmm. You don't have to go on social media and begin to fight people up and down. People don't even know you and all of that. 
And I know that we're going places. You're a wonderful Thank conversation. Thank you so much. I mean, <laughs> sit down with you. We we'll won't, spend yeah, hours we'll finish. Yeah. Just let's round up. Maybe the website, uh, social media, how do people just get to okay, access to you? Okay, www.actorsgivesnigeria.org. Okay. We are setting a uniform platform okay. that will take care of all of this I have mentioned. So it's all just right. a one tap away. If all you're right. in Ogoja, just click. Just click. Act and all right. of Thank that. you so much. Thank I was a pleasure having you on the show. And wishing you the best. Keep on doing what you're doing. Thank right. you. So, uh